This video looks at a new feature in CalRoads View, which makes Cal3Q HCR project setup faster than ever. The Cal3Q HCR model is an enhanced version of the Cal3Q HC model, which analyzes ambient pollutant concentrations originating from motor vehicle emissions. The model allows processing of up to one year of hourly meteorological observations and the inclusion of vehicular emissions, traffic volume, and signalization data also referred to as ETS data. Modelers can input one set of ETS data for the entire model run, which is referred to as a Tier 1 analysis, or input up to seven sets of hourly conditions for a more refined model run, referred to as the Tier 2 analysis. While this refined approach can produce more accurate concentrations, simply inputting the data to the model can take a long time. Starting in CalRoads View version 6.5, you can enter all your ETS data into a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet for quick and easy import to CalRoads View. First, set up your Cal3Q HCR project in CalRoads View. When setting your job options, make sure to select the Tier 2 approach. After you've input all your links, you can begin setting up your spreadsheet. Select the Pattern Options Toolbar button. The program will have an empty pattern waiting for data input. From here, select the Export Pattern button to create a ready-to-use spreadsheet customized to your project's data. Microsoft Excel will automatically open after you click that button. The spreadsheet contains a detailed header describing each data column. The parameters are color-coded to the link type, free flow, or queue. Populate the spreadsheet with your project's data. When complete, save the spreadsheet. Each spreadsheet you create represents a single pattern. You can have up to seven patterns in a single project. Repeat this process for as many spreadsheets as there are patterns. When you're done creating your spreadsheets, go back to CalRoads View, and in the Patterns Options window, select the Import Pattern button. Use the New button to create new patterns, while using the same Import Pattern button to import each new pattern. After importing all the patterns, select the Weekday button and set which day of the week each pattern will apply to. In this example, we're setting PT1 to Monday through Friday, PT2 to Saturday, and PT3 to Sunday. Using this method to import your pattern data can greatly reduce project setup times, allowing you to run your models and get results faster than ever before. To learn more about our products, visit our website, www.weblakes.com. Thank you for watching.